In today's video, I'm gonna set myself a massive challenge. I'm gonna see if it's possible to go from zero to earning over $10,000 online. Obviously, I've been making money in lots of different ways over the last few years, but a lot of people want to see me start from zero, having no money at all. So I've decided to take the challenge on and see whether I can do it. The rules are, I can't use any money, obviously, and I can't use my following. So it is gonna be pretty tough. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do it. I've got a few different ideas and strategies that I can, that I can try out, and we're gonna see whether it works. So let's dive into it. For the first part of the challenge, I decided to head to fiverr.com and try to offer a service in exchange for some money. The downside to Fiverr is it's very, very competitive. So it is quite hard, but this is the only option I've got, I think. I, I think I need to get onto a trend, something which is trended at the moment and offer a service around that. And also offer something which is obviously fairly new, so not a lot of people are offering that service. I had a little idea before, and I think this is pretty genius, and I think it could work well. So you might know that there's a new app on the block, um, an audio app called Clubhouse, so it, um, it's this one here. And basically, it's, it's an audio app where people can talk in rooms, and, and a lot of entrepreneurs are using it. So on the app, people, the only thing that you can see when someone is speaking is a profile picture. Um, but what a lot of these top speakers are now doing is they're kind of making their profile pictures stand out by adding borders around them or cool backgrounds behind them. So I feel like this is probably the most trending thing that I can think of that's very easy for me to do because I could just do that on Canva. So I'm going to give it a go anyway and see whether I can get any sales. I've uploaded it, it's live. So let's hope that we're going to get some organic people searching for this. Um, and we'll see how it goes from there. I'll keep you updated. Okay, so it's the next day now. My Fiverr gig has been up overnight. So now is the moment of truth to see whether I've had any sales. I've not checked it this morning, so I'm gonna log into my account and check it. I'm hoping that I would have had at least one sale, but we're gonna find out now. Let's log in and check it out. I failed you. You trusted me. And I failed you. Zero orders. I mean, I knew, I, to be fair, I didn't think I was gonna have any orders this soon. I only created one gig, but zero orders. That's a bit of a blow. Obviously, I need to try and change this up a little bit. The good news is, I've had 20 impressions and seven clicks. So it is reaching people and I'm getting clicks. So I do think it is a matter of time before I actually make one sale. While I was waiting for the Fiverr sales to come rolling in, I knew that I had to diversify and think of some other income streams. So I decided to hit up my old mate Google and after trawling through a lot of crappy options, I stumbled across a few sites that offered to pay you for taking free trials. And I saw some good reviews for them, so I decided to give them a go. The one that I've seen popping up is called Oh My Dosh, which is this website here. Um, it's a UK one. There's quite a few different ones. There's one called Inbox Dollars as well in America, which is a similar kind of setup. They pay you out if you sign up for a trial, like a TV subscription plan and you get a free trial. And then what you can do is cancel the subscription or cancel your membership before they take the money out and you can keep the cash. So I'm gonna give that a go now and see. So I've got some good news. I finally have some money in the kitty. So the challenge is off to a start. I'm so happy I've been on this website, signing up for trials for things. And so far it says here, you'll see here I've earned six pounds, but I've actually signed up to more things, but some of them take a little while to process. So the total that I've earned so far is 11 pounds 25. With this challenge, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do it in dollars mainly because it looks like more and it's going to be easier to hit $10,000 than it is to hit £10,000. So the total so far, the running total that I've made is $15.43 in the bank. Now some of these offers pay out within like 24 hours into my bank and I can withdraw them, but some of them take a little bit longer. So I'm not just going to pause the challenge and wait for this to be paid into my bank. I'm just going to add that to the kitty and use that and move on to the next, next part of this challenge because I just want to keep the momentum and keep the ball rolling. Morning guys, so first of all, excuse the morning head because I've just jumped out of bed, but I've got some really good news. 
So last night, just before I was about to go to bed, an order came through on Fiverr. So someone's ordered my gig on Fiverr. So what I did is I, I just, I did, I fulfilled the order straight away. I just got their picture, added the, the board around it, sent it off to them. And then while I was asleep, they, they obviously approved it, give me five stars, which was amazing. Um, and then even better news happened. I've just woken up and another order has come through um, about 3 a.m. while I was asleep. So that five star rating is probably helping me rank now um, and it's hopefully gonna snowball from here. So I'm gonna do the order now um, and hopefully some more orders are gonna start coming through throughout the rest of the day and we can start building up that cash so we can move it into something else a little bit later. Just finished the second Fiverr order. Um, Fiverr takes $1 out of each of them, so you get $4 per order, which means another $8 into the bank, which means we're currently at a total of $23.43. It's slow progress, but we are making progress. For the next part of the challenge, I think I need to take it up a level and start earning some bigger chunks of money. I mean, the Fiverr gigs are still ticking away in the background, but it's gonna take me forever to get to $10,000 if I'm just selling little $5 gigs here and there. So I've been having a little browse around and I was looking at what's trending at the moment. And one thing that is trending at the moment is cryptocurrency. Um, as you see here, it is literally peaking again. There's a lot of hype around cryptocurrency, um, almost as much hype as there was in 2017 when it was at its peak. So I was like, how can I capitalize on this new trend? It's, it's trending, a lot of people are speaking about it. Um, so there must be an opportunity to make money at the moment with cryptocurrency. Now, I don't know much about cryptocurrency and I've not got enough money to, to invest into cryptocurrency and make any kind of good returns. So I'm not gonna be investing in cryptocurrency. But I just I was thinking how I can still jump on this trend. So what I did is I went back to Trusty Fiverr and I searched crypto just to see what, what people were selling on Fiverr um, for crypto, just doing a bit of research. And I noticed this gig here called Bitcoin News Site. And it says, I will build autopilot crypto Bitcoin news site for passive income. And there's actually quite a few people, not loads, but there's a few people offering this same service where they basically will build you an automated news website which automatically publishes news stories about cryptocurrency and basically um, they will create you one you can add your own logo to it and you can use it to earn passive income or add adverts on this is an example of one here this is one that one of these five gigs have created it's called crypto lovers so if I bought that gig, I could get this website created for me. This is quite a good idea, it's a good gig. I'm not gonna actually buy this gig and, and get one of these sites made for me, which I think it's quite a good idea, but I think it'll take too long. It's a slow process because it'll take a long time to actually rank this site for SEO um, and add my banner ads on it and I probably won't make that much money that fast. So I'm not gonna be a customer of this gig, but what I'm actually going to do is do drop servicing. So I've spoken about this on my channel in the past and what drop servicing is, is where I create a website offering a service um, and then someone will come to my site to purchase that service and then what I will do is outsource and get someone else to create that or fulfill that service for a cheaper price and I keep the difference in profit. So what I've decided to do, what I think is a great idea, I think this could work quite well, is I'm gonna um, basically offer this service i'm going to say i will build my my agency or my company will build you a fully automated crypto news website um and i'll say it's going to cost like 99 dollars or or 200 dollars. i'm not sure on the price yet and then if someone buys it off my website i'll come to fiverr and i can place the order and there's actually one guy here that's offering it for 15 pounds, which is probably around about $20. So if I can sell this service for $100 on my own website or $200, there's a quite a large markup in profit that I can make. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna buy a cheap domain for about a dollar. Then I'm gonna to go to Kartra, which is a website builder and sales funnel builder. I'm gonna sign up for a trial for this. You can get a 30 day trial for a dollar. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create the service on that. So I've been busy working away on this site, building this site out in Kartra. I'll just quickly show you. So I've called it Crypto News Pros, and it says make passive income with your own fully automated crypto news website. And then just explain what they're getting, a little breakdown of the features here, and then an option where they can basically purchase it. 
So it's the next day now, and my crypto news website is now live. Um, I've created this basic little Instagram page. And now basically what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go and follow loads of crypto pages, crypto meme pages, crypto news pages, all of these Instagram pages. And what I've decided to do is drop them all a little quick voice note, tell them that I'm offering this service. Um, so let's go for it. Hey there, first of all, I'll keep this really quick, but first service where we automated crypto news site or site. So we require zero me for five sites practically. So I've just spent so long recording voice notes. I've literally left messages for so many people. Um, so hopefully some of them will start coming back. One person's got back to me and they kind of talked to me a little bit. Hopefully some more people will get back and we can hopefully get a few orders in as soon as possible. So it feels like I've been doing this challenge for so long and I've not made as much progress as I thought I would do. It's been a very slow process getting these first bits of money coming in, but I'm about to probably do the biggest riskiest thing that I can do and risk all of the money I've made so far in the hope that I'm gonna make a lot more. I'll explain what I'm gonna do in just a second, but I'm gonna show you where I'm up to so far and kind of what, what I've made so far. So. I've sold four Fiverr gigs doing these clubhouse profile pictures. Two of them have given me a tip, which means I've earned $24 from Fiverr so far, which is not bad. And then obviously on top of that, I've got the Oh My Dosh, um, the money from Oh My Dosh, which I made $15 40 free. And then I'm gonna take away from that the um, $1.35 for the domain. I got a 99 pence domain in the UK, but that's $1.35 it cost me for that. And then 99 cents for cart draw, which means so far I've got a grand total of $37.09, which is not a lot of money. And I've still been trying to make this crypto business work. So I've been inboxing a lot of people on Instagram, sending them the voice notes. Not that many people have got back to be honest, but I've been to and fro in. Um, and some people are slightly interested and they've said, yeah, yeah, potentially, and I'm trying to still close those sales. But again, that's a slow process. So what I've decided to do as well is see whether anyone can do a shout out. I've been trying to inbox some people. I've nearly got scammed. So I found another person, which seems like they might be okay. Um, and basically they've said they could do a story and swipe up for $35 and they accept PayPal um, and they're getting like 10,000 views on, on their stories. So I'm about to pay for that now, but I just wanna show you um, another little thing which I think is gonna help us make some money. So obviously I've got this page here, um, my Crypto News Pros business, but what I've done is to try and get some more sales coming in quicker. Um, I've basically added this countdown timer that says the next five people will get a thousand dollar site for just $97 um, if they use code SPECIAL5. And then I've created a little image that I'm gonna get them to share on the story, which I'll put on my screen now, uh, basically saying I'm giving away five sites for super, super cheap. Hopefully some people are gonna sign up for that. So that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna pay for this guy's invoice. Hope that he doesn't scam me because I've chatted to a few people that seem like they're a bit scammy. Um, hope that we get some sales from this and we can start seeing some 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 money coming in but it is i'm gonna have to spend my last 35 dollars basically my entire budget i'm gonna have like two dollars left so it is a big risk but that's what entrepreneurs do they take risks so let's hope it pays off so it's the next day and the instagram shout out that i paid for yesterday has been up for 24 hours and i've got some results so i'm going to log into my um carter account and show you what's happened so far with that so this is the Carter account that I set up specifically for this challenge. And as you can see, free sales and total revenue of $291. Woo! More money, more money! Yes. I am absolutely buzzing. Now I'll break this down for you because they all didn't come from the Instagram shout out. So I had two sales yesterday. Um, and they came quite soon after I, I paid for this Instagram shout out. So I'm guessing they both came from that. Now I can't guarantee that because I've not been tracking it, which is quite stupid. Um, but they did come quite soon after that shout out, but I have had my link all over the place on Twitter, um, on Instagram, inboxing people, sharing in my, it's in my bio. So there's a chance it could have come from somewhere else, those sales, but I'm guessing, I'm gonna say they came from them Instagram shout outs, which if they did, that's a very good position to be in because I spent $35 and made revenue of $194 back. Now I have got to pay for the service, well, I'll mention that in a minute, 
but $194 is good. And then today I've got another sale come in of $97. Now this isn't from the Instagram shout out. This is actually from me messaging people on Instagram. So as you remember, I did a lot of voice notes. I contacted a lot of people um, and I basically been messaging them saying, do you want me to offer you this service? We'll give you the first five um, for $97 in exchange for a review. Like I said, we'll do it really cheap in exchange for a review. I had quite a few people interested um, and then one person, one page, they basically got back. They said they were interested and then today I managed to close them and they signed up for it. So that is another sale in the bag. So in total, $291 in sales for that little service, that drop service thing that I set up, which is amazing. Now, obviously there's costs that I have to pay for on top of that. So for each one of those sales, I need to spend $20 on Fiverr to order that gig, and then there's a $3 fee on top. So out of that $291, $69 of that is the costs that it's costing me, which means, so far, if you include the $2.09 that I already had left over, I've got a total of $224.09 in the bank. Now that's not it because the Fiverr gig is still pulling through and doing quite well. So last night I got another Fiverr order come through um, where I earned $4 from that. And then today I got another Fiverr gig come through, another $4, but then he gave me a tip. So in total, I got another $8 on top of that. So that means I've got a grand total of $236.09, which I am so, so happy about because this time last week, I started this challenge with zero and it has taken a lot of effort. And I know $236 is not an amazing amount of money, but the hardest part is starting with nothing and building up to this stage. And as you can see, once you've got a bit of money to pay for paid traffic, whether that's Instagram shout outs or other paid traffic, you can actually grow your money a lot, lot faster. And that's what I'm gonna be focusing on more in the next part of this challenge. So make sure you hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed, hit the like button if you like this challenge and this series and you want me to continue on to get up to $10,000. And let me know in the comments if you've got any other ideas of different ways that I can use to make money in the next video. Um, thank you for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. It took a long time to record and if you want me to carry on making content like this, just make sure you let me know in the comments. Thanks a lot. Speak to you soon. Cheers.